welcome back to my channel guys so i'm frying some chicken here it's friday it's my preparation day now i am going to be making a bread now that bread it's different from what we we would normally you know it's not the same needed thing or needed really into a dough but i'm gonna show you step by step or somewhat what it is that i'm doing stay tuned these are some of the ingredients that i will be using i have poured some flour already into a bowl here and it's the almond flour that i'll be using i'm gonna be blending some of the trail mix along with some almond nuts some butter my baking soda bake, baking powder sorry and i'll be combining all the dry ingredients together in my blender I am not using actually everything that is in the packets, so I'm picking out some of the stuff that I do need. Good? I'm just picking out some of the stuff. That's what the bag, um, that is what's in the bag. So I'm going to re be removing some of the pecans, walnuts, whatever nuts are in there to go in the blender here. So I'm not actually using um, those raisins and um, normal cranberries. I'm not using them in there. And these white things. I'm not even sure what they are. My son bought it to try to test it. And I don't think he liked it. So I am using them. So I'm, and my hands are clean. I always wash my hands. Okay, guys? So I am making a bread using nuts. Uh-oh, that one fell. Using mostly nuts. Almonds, pecans, walnuts. Yes. And I will let you know how it how it went, you know. Gotta try something, try new stuff. So this is one of the new stuff that I'm trying. So guys, pray for me. Walnuts, pecans, almonds. Yeah. I needed some maca maca macadamia nuts. Macadamia? Yes, I think that's what it's called. I need some of those nuts. But for right now, this is the trail mix that I showed you before. I am combining everybody into one stuff, into one thing. All right? I'm going to try and blend as much as I can these dry ingredients, okay? It's going to be a kind of it's going to be kind of rough on the ears because I know it's going to be a lot of noise. so guys i'm blending i have blended it out somewhat but there's still a lot of um i have to kind of sift it through but there is still a lot of roughage so i'm gonna blend it again so it takes a little bit of you have to have a little bit of patience to deal with this thing this thing that I'm making, I'm trying to make these things myself because um, you don't know how gonna fill them bread. When you're there Jamaica and you buy one bread, well, a bread can last more than a week, more than probably two days, depending on the size bread. Because I used to eat bread a lot. Yeah, I used to eat bread a lot. So. Here 
it's not the same thing for me that is anyway so I'm trying to make my own kind of healthy a healthy way so I'm trying something new I don't know how it's gonna turn out but you will surely know all right so this these are my nuts I have even blended some oats I don't remember if I told you that oats was also in there so I am sifting this through and this is what it looks like this is what it looks like guys yes all right so I've mixed it up here these are all the dried ingredients everything wasn't blended out but I've also added some I've also added some baking powder in there I'm gonna put some butter and this is egg with milk and I placed two bananas inside so this is a nut nut fruit bread or nut banana bread it's not really banana because you will get a slight hint of the banana but it's mostly nuts my people this is not my bread pan this is not my bread pan but guess what then said dog we sleep and yard we have too much yard go to them bed without dinner this is what me have to go bake my bread into i mean like when me, me, me have the bread tin but i don't have it here me have too much yard so i dare me add a yard you understand so i gotta use this one to bake my bread but stay tuned i'm crumbling my butter in there guys my baking powder is in there and my butter so i'm crumbling my butter I have added just a little bit of flour in there I won't lie to you just about just a handful just a handful of regular flour because I'm not sure if it's gonna crumble or it will stay together but I shouldn't have added it I should have just gone ahead and um, bake, bake all of this to see what the outcome would be so I'm gonna also add this mixture this is the banana egg and milk I'm gonna add that in here all right guys and as I said before my hands are clean My hands are clean, guys. I don't need all of that mixture. All right, so it's all, it's all together now. So in my pan, I should have, um, I should have preheated my oven, but I did not because I was I totally forgot and I was doing other stuff so I am going to let you see this is truly how I do it when I'm pretty up nothing this is just what I do I am the one eating it so it is now it has come together see and I have forgotten this is what it looks like it's kind of pasty it's pasty regular normally when I bake regular bread I knead it into a dough and put and put it to um to proof I'm not doing it like this because time is winding up on me so I use baking powder instead of yeast <laughs> 